An important distinction with crafted consumables is that many of their ingredients are not standard raw materials, particularly meat and produce for cooking, and a variety of items, such as a Braxo cleaner, bloatfly gland, pencil, stimpaks, chems, etc., for chemistry. The workshop's choice of junk items to scrap when crafting, when multiple options are available, is not clear. If the player wants to save certain items for sale, e.g. trading pre-war money for bottle caps rather than scrapping it for cloth, or consumables crafting, see previous note, they need to either be used up first or kept separate from both the player's inventory and the workshop storage. Only junk will automatically be consumed during crafting, never weapons or armor. Those can only be converted to raw materials by manual scrapping. Collapsed buildings, cars, street lamps, almost anything lying about within a workstation area can be scrapped for building materials. While being in workshop mode, the player can highlight any of those objects. To scrap them, press the square button for PS4, X for Xbox One, or R for PC. All items on or in scrapped containers or attached items will be moved to the workshop storage, accessible from any crafting station, or from the workbench itself. Scrapping a non-container object such as seating, shop sinks, most tables, shelves, etc. will cause any attached, touching items to disappear from the game. Take, scrap, store such items before scrapping the supporting object. Scrapping a crafted item when another crafted item is attached will not scrap both items, only the highlighted item is scrapped. The other item will be moved to the workbench. Many movable objects outside the boundaries of a settlement, e.g. the engine under the bridge off Sanctuary's south side, steel barrels, smaller tires, traffic cones, can be carried into a settlement and then scrapped. When curating junk inventory, a gear is not itself a crafting component, but gears is. Crafting ammunition like in Fallout, New Vegas was originally non-existent in Fallout 4 except for ammo for the syringer. This was expanded upon in the Contraptions Workshop add-on, which brought the ammunition plant, allowing for all 10 ammunition types to be crafted with rank 4 of the gun nut perk. Another addition of craftable ammunition came with Nuka World. By acquiring the Nuka Nuke schematics, one can craft Nuka Nukes.